Bob and Corinne Frick are both described as hardworking and dedicated, so when mutual friends introduce them, it's not surprising they hit it off. We both have the same interests and uh, we communicate well with each other. We like to travel, we like to work out, we like to cook, we like to spend time with our family, so uh, it's a good fit. Their love of food and new challenges brought them to Ohio in the mid-1980s. I love to cook and I love a challenge. Luckily, he and I were both up for the challenge at that time. With a strong family history and personal history of heart problems, Bob's journey to Ohio State Ross Heart Hospital is a long one. I was under construction in our restaurant in Dayton, Ohio when I had the heart attack. And uh, then uh, I was in Arkansas when I had to have a triple bypass in 1999. And um, after the triple bypass, I developed atrial fibrillation. And then in 2005, because of the atrial fib, I had a stroke. And I've had a couple syncopes on the treadmill where I black out. And that's when they discovered I probably needed a defibrillator. And I've had four of those. The Fricks have always tried to help their employees get ahead. So it was only natural that they eventually turned to community philanthropy. It started uh, with me uh, when I had um, heart difficulties and got treated at uh, Ohio State. And I saw how dedicated and how, how hard all the clinicians and the researchers and the support staff worked. And uh, I just thought, you know, if I'm ever in a position to help, I'll do it. And we've been lucky enough to meet Peter Moeller and with the Frick Center find out about the research. And so um, we see the research being translated. Because the research that's going on, and they can relate that to the operating room. What they discover in the research area, they can implement in the, the hybrid suite. You have to have the best for the best. So I think that's why it's so important that the community realizes what they have here and uh, if they can, uh, you know, a lot of people volunteer their time, but... Which is great. It's Fantastic. That's wonderful. And, uh, but if they can uh, do more than that and they can see what they do, uh, it's also uh, so comforting to them to know that their money is going for, to help people's lives and make a better life for these families. All these things are in our lifetime we feel are going to go from uh, research to clinical. And the nice thing about it, we can see while we're here what's going on and see the people we help. 